The next step that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take and cut a piece of thread that's maybe about, hmm, one and a half feet long. If you make your thread too long, you're going to end up getting knots, which is horrible. And we're going to go ahead and thread it. Now on your little kit supply, you'll have had a needle and thread. We're gonna go ahead and cut this thread off. That's just to kind of help it stay in place. And then we're gonna go ahead and thread this needle. Now I'll pull one end of the thread right here and I can see the eye of the needle and I'm gonna go ahead and poke that right through the eye of the needle. Now I'm gonna be honest with you, sometimes it's easy. That was easy. Sometimes it's not. So this is gonna sound really gross, but I'm gonna take this end of this thread and I'm gonna put it in my mouth and I'm gonna layer it with some spit. Make it nice and wet and then that's gonna make it so that it goes through the eye of the needle easier. There are all sorts of fuzzies or fiber ends that are on the end of your um, thread that sometimes make it difficult to thread. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this so that the ends are close to each other in um, how long they are, but not quite. Then I'm gonna take the longer of the two and I have to tie a knot. So I'm gonna come up close and I want you to see this. All right, I'm coming up close and this is what I want you to do. I, I want you to fold this around and then I want you to take this tail and I want you to tuck it under and come back up once under and back up twice and under and back up a third time. And now you've twisted it around itself a number of times and then you're just gonna pull that and it's gonna make a pretty good sized knot. You're gonna take the end of that um, thread and whatever's maybe about a quarter of an inch or longer, you're just gonna take and, oops, I'm gonna try that again, clip that right off, good? All right, 